celebrated tonight that I go out of jury duty. Hooray! <laughs> and I managed to fill the entire studio with people who also were at court today. <laughs> Laugh or you're going back there! <laughs> you ready, Jeff? I like it. Nice touch. What time would it be, Jeffrey Peters? It's time for Eats and Twee Mails, sponsored by the National Mispronunciation Society, or the S... <laughs> or the SNPN, as it's known. <laughs> hey, Jeff, you want to get Twee with me tonight? Well, all right! Pedal to the pedal again, there soon. Drag me out of bed. Clearwater, Florida. You ever been to Clearwater, Florida? Got a little place there. I like to go swimming, get naked with people. What the hell, man? You usually join in there. Why the hell am I keep going to myself? Yeah. myself? I like alligators. They're from Florida, aren't they? Not all of them. There no, are not all of them. Not all of them. There are some alligators from Florida. There are alligators from um, other areas. Yes. Uh, they like it there, don't they? Because it's you know watery and warm. Well, it's watery and warm in other places too. True. And there are no alligators there, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> I meant in my pants. Oh, in your pants. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, that yeah. in my pants. That thing that you always used to say before. Yeah, you, you know, we've had, we've had a new chip in, so in my pants is, you know, sometimes it comes and goes, you know. <laughs> There's a new catchphrase no, to it. No, no, oh, what no. No, it comes and goes in oh, your in pants. pants. Yeah, oh. We'll get there, we'll get there eventually, we'll get there eventually. Give me time, give me time. I'm giving you time. Pay my pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, this is from Paul in Clearwater, Florida. It says, Dear Craig and Jeff, I am thinking about quitting my job in accounting and moving into a career in law enforcement. My wife's not too happy about it. Any tips on how to persuade her? Grow a moustache. <laughs> <laughs> That's what women like. Grow a moustache and she'll be yours forever. Right, Jeff? Yeah, grow a moustache for Movember. It's Movember, isn't it? Do you know about Movember? No, what's Movember? Movember is uh, where men grow moustaches throughout November to uh, raise awareness about prostate cancer. <laughs> I, w I will be growing one. The hell? It's true, it's true. Is that the only way to do it? Isn't there another? Can't we do another one? What about having a, a march or a parade or a... Yeah, you could talk about it or, you know, write about it, but, I mean, I think it's a good idea to grow a moustache. Well, I don't... Whenever I see someone with a moustache, I don't go, ooh, that's right, I better have my prostate checked. That doesn't... <laughs> that doesn't make sense... Well, actually, now as I think about it... In a way, I suppose I sometimes think that. If it's Tom Selleck's moustache. I tried growing a moustache once here on the show and people were outraged. Well, what you do is, because you don't normally grow a moustache, when you've grown one throughout November, people go, oh, look at you, you've grown a moustache. And you go, yes, I've grown a moustache to commemorate. Well, not commemorate, but raise awareness of... <laughs> yeah, but wait, wait, but wait. Prostate it takes me more than a month to grow a moustache. Really? Yes, I've got a very uh, feeble... Hair. Oh, you should rub your facial hair in whale sputum. <laughs> well, who's to say that I don't do that? It still doesn't grow very much. <laughs> Works for me. <laughs> Actually, it doesn't. You don't have a moustache. This is from Elizabeth in Green Bay, Wisconsin. You ever been to Green Bay, Wisconsin? Got a little place I like to go swimming? Love the cat. Love the Packers. <laughs> which is what I originally said, but the Packers. No, I think, love the Cackers. As, uh, oh, that's I love the fun. Cackers. <laughs> All right. Uh, hello, Craig and Jeff. I told my boyfriend he's put on a little weight. Too much for someone so short. <laughs> I think I crossed the line. Did I? You bet you did. Yeah. You might get shanked. <laughs> that's the kind of talk that I come out with now I've been down at the Criminal Justice Center. <laughs> right, Jeff? You got a cold, steely glaze I have. tonight. I've got prison eyes. <laughs> Are you hiding a hacksaw in your bum? No! My pants! Oh, your pants, yeah! Hell, man! 
<laughs> anyway, uh, the Mitch in Raleigh, North Carolina says, uh, Craig, my roommate has a new girl almost every night and it's getting out of hand. How do I tell him to cool it? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's called jealousy. Yeah, I think, that, I think that's exactly what that's called, Jeff. It's called jealousy. <laughs> I'm thinking of getting a spider web tattoo here. What do you think? Brilliant idea. Brilliant. Yeah, right up here. It'll yeah. give me that real prison house look. Brilliant. Spider web tattoo up here. Maybe a grenade here. <laughs> and then I thought I would have eyes tattooed on my eyes. <laughs> so that when I'm asleep, the other cons will think I'm still awake. Yeah. And be and wary of me. They'll call you crazy eyes. Crazy <laughs> eyes. I'll be like, here comes crazy eyes. And I'll be like, yeah. <laughs> You have to imagine the crazy eyes painted on. Oh, I can imagine it, all right. Good. In my pants. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. Well, you're a quick study. Uh, all right, I know we're out of time, so just one more, all right? One more, two more, three more. I'll just get through the lot of them then. We're out of time. I know. All right, this is from uh, Brett in Overland Park, Kansas. says, hi, Craig and Jeff. I'm scheduled for jury duty next week. Any helpful tips? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, pretend to be Scottish, get a spider web tattoo. Uh, this is from Pamela in Dover, Delaware. It says, Dear Craig and Jeff, what do you do when you have the whole house to yourself? Jeff? Um, I like to just lie down and think about life. <laughs> is that code? Yeah. Okay. This is from Matt in Maple Grove, Minnesota. Hi, Craig. A woman in a parking lot asked me to drive her around to find her car. I asked her out afterwards and she said yes. Is this crazy? <laughs> Sounds a little weird, actually, yeah. What do you think? Well, I mean, I think there's different ways to find dates nowadays, and, you know, anytime I'm you can think outside I'm trying to get through this box. quickly! I'm trying you to speed read these things. You're like, well, I don't know. <laughs> think about it. If you think about it, come Look for on! a one-word answer. A one-word answer? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Craig and Jeff. In your relationship experience, do you think the opposites really attract, or do they have to be some commonalities? Don't care. Uh... <laughs> This is from Tam in Melbourne, Australia. You ever been to Australia? Got a little place there? Like to go swimming, bounce up, down been, to kangaroos, been, feel the testicles, been, that kind of thing? Uh, this is from Tam in Melbourne, Australia. Hi, Craig. One of my good friend's farewell parties is coming up soon. Do you have any ideas for a good gift on a budget? Jelly. <laughs> what do you do? Jello. What? Jello. <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty good gift. How much, though? Well, how much Jello? Yeah. Litre. Hey, you're in America now, buddy. Uh, six fluid ounces. <laughs> That's not right. Oh. All right, we've got to take a break. We'll be right back. We'll be right back.